multiplying whole numbers and fractions. I think you guys can do number one on your own. What is one sixth of 18? What is four sixths of 18? And then fill in the blank to make a true number sentence. 18 times four sixths equals what? Number two is a little more tricky. First, we need to know what is 15 times three. So 15 plus 15 plus 15, because multiplication is repeated addition. 5, 10, 15, carry my 1, 1, 2, 3, 4, so 45. Now it's asking, what is 45 divided by 8? So I'm just going to switch it up here. I know 8 goes into 45. We're going to cross these out. 5 times. 5 times 4, or 5 times 8 is 40. I have 5 left over. And I can write that as a fraction. I can write it as 5 eighths. So my answer is 5 and 5 eighths. C says, what is 5 times 3 divided by 8? Well, we already know that. We know what 15 times 3 is. And we know what 45 divided by 8 is. So... 5 and 5 eighths is your same answer. You need to write it. I don't have enough space to write. Then it says, fill in the blank to make a number sentence true. So what is 15 times 3 eighths? So 15 times 3 eighths is ex what we have found. 5 and 5 eighths. And this is how we do it. So we have 15 and let's imagine it over 1 times 3 over 8. 15 times 3 is 45 over 8. I can't leave that as an improper fraction. I know 8 goes into 45 5 times, which is 40. I have 5 left over, over my 8. So now I'm going to erase that work. And I'm going to do... Number four, but I will read number three to you. Three says, the art teacher has seven bottles of glue that are each two-fifths full. He combines them so he will have fewer bottles. How many bottles of glue does he have after he combines them all? You need a number model and your answer. Show your work. Four says, the librarian needs to return 24 books. So up here, I'm going to write 24. In one hour, she finished three-fourths of the job. How many books has she returned to the shelf so far? So I know my numbers. 24 and three-fourths. So my number model is going to be 24 times three-fourths equals question mark. So just like I showed you before, you can do 24 well, what, first of all, we can do what is one-fourth of 24. So how many times does four, four go into 24? So one-fourth would be six. So that's if we did our six, 12, 18, 24. So that would be one-fourth, two-fourths, three-fourths. So the answer is 18 books. Practice. For problems 5 through 7, round each decimal to the nearest tenth. Tenth. That T-H sound. Tenth. And then for problems 8 through 10, round each decimal to the nearest hundredth. Hundredth. 